For some it is, for some it isn't. For God it's nothing. Frederick Lehman wrote the music to a song called The Love of God. But the words originate much earlier than that, in the year 1050. That's going way back. In a city called Worms in Germany, there was a Jewish man who wrote the Hadamut, and the verses of the Hadamut was a Jewish poem. And those verses are the ones that is, are in the love of God. The last verse was found in a jail on the wall. Someone had given his life to Christ and wrote down, though the oceans are filled with all the ink, it is not possible to write about the love of God. This is the song called The Love of God. <clears throat> Love of God is greater far than tongue or pen can ever tell. It goes beyond the highest star and reaches to the lowest hell. When evil times shall pass away and earthly thrones and kingdoms fall, when men here refuse to pray on rocks and hills and mountains call, God's love so sure shall endure all measureless and strong, redeeming, redeeming grace to Adam's race. The saints and angels song. Now this was found on the wall of the prison. Imagine that, way back at 1050. Could we with ink the ocean feel and were the skies of parchment made where every stalk on earth a quill and every man a scribe by trade to write the love of God above would drain the ocean dry nor could the scroll contain the whole though stretched from sky Yeah. 